All right, guys, um, this is Guy from Diddy Studios. In this video, a lot of people have been asking me how to use the layer slider with the, uh, with the theme, which is pretty much the slider that you see in the live preview, the one that moves around, the elements move. Um, basically, in the documentation, uh, it says you should refer to the uh, plugin documentation, and it's included with your files. I'll get to that in a bit. Uh, first things first, uh, when you're using the layer slider, these slides don't, uh, they're not used because uh, we're using the, uh, the plugin itself. Basically, when you come in your custom admin panel, you have all these options. And when you select layer slider, pretty much all we're doing is reading the theme to, um, for the plugin. So if you, if you do want to use layer slider other than the other ones, which, which use images, um, you have to select layer slider. Uh, some of these options will take place. So the height, um, the slider border, and that's pretty much it. All the rest is used with uh, the other sliders. So if you're using the layer slider, make sure you select it, um, you save your changes. And once the changes are saved, what you want to do is install the layer slider plugin. Uh, that's included with your download file. So when you have when you um, when you download your files, basically all you get is a zip file and you one zip, you get all these folders. The layer slider will be in in the plugins folder and layer slide. Now the documentation for the layer slide is right here. So you want to open this this um, this document here, which is document documentation WordPress. And you end up with this with this page. Now this is the documentation for the plugin. So when you're using the plugin to insert slides into the um, into the into the theme, that's uh, what you want to refer to in, um, when you uh, when you are adding slides. And it actually has a, a really nice video that sort of gives you a, an overall um, view of the um, of of how to add and how it works. The uh, WYS wide. WYG editor, uh, which is pretty good. Uh, you should definitely look into that. Um, but right now, what we're looking at is installing. So we go to plugins, we add new. Uh, you can see that up here that I'm actually working on the live preview as we speak. You just click upload, choose your file. Now you just you just pick your file. Basically, the file that you want to pick is. Um, this layer slide WordPress plugin, the zip file. So basically, you just select this file here, install now, activate it. Once you activate it, we'll, you will end up with this button here at the uh, top left, which is your your um, your slide. So you're going to create a new slide, and you're going to end up with all these options. Now that's where this documentation comes into place. Um, it comes already with all the um, default uh, settings. So with heights, that's the default settings for the uh, for the theme. If you change, uh, that's very important. If you change the height of your slide here, which is 400 by default, if let's say you put 350, you will need to change the height on the plugin as well. So keep that in mind. You need to change this to 350 if you change that as well. Now all these options you can actually refer to the layer slide WordPress documentation. Um, it's not really hard. Um, just give it a quick look. You most people probably will not um, use all these options. They're kind of um, pointless. Uh, it's just really advanced stuff. I myself didn't use it. Um, and to start adding new slides, all you want to do is come here to uh, to the bottom where you can add new slides. So this is my um, all my slides. Um, basically, all you have to do is just add a new layer and starting adding your your slides. Uh, make sure you add a background, which is the background image. Um, I have different backgrounds for each um, for each slide, and then you start adding your elements here, which can be an image. In these ones, I have actually have um, HTML, which is for the button here, um, and you can just you can always just sort of like drag and drop these and it's it's rather easy to use um, yeah it's it's really really simple to use um, you don't have you don't really necessarily have to sort of um, add many uh, many options as it comes with the default options of for the theme um, yeah that's it um, if you guys need any help please don't hesitate in contacting us on the um, um, on the documentation, there's a link for a support page. You can uh, contact us on Skype and on um, iMessage. Um, I'm just going to remove this layer. And 
that's pretty much it. Um, I will get into more details in the next video on how these sublayers work, just so um, everybody's clear about that. And thanks for watching. This is pretty much just how you install the, the, the plugin and how you use it. So um, I'll see you guys in the next video.